Tags are a great way to manage complex scenes. They're also a useful tool you can use to help you focus on specific tasks as they can be used to isolate items in both the viewport and the scene window. To slide open the tag window, click the button at the bottom left hand corner of the scene window. First, let's talk about two of the built-in tags. One filters by label color and the other by element type. These are populated for you by Cavalry. You can activate a tag by clicking on it. Notice that when I click the red tag, only elements with the red label are shown in the viewport. If I assign a different color to one element, say purple, a new color option appears in the tag window. I can add other items to this color tag by either changing their label color in the scene window or by dragging them onto the tag in the tag window. Drag and drop is the easiest way to assign tags. At the top of the tag window, there's a header with a drop down menu. This menu dictates what happens when you click on a tag. Activating a tag can either select the elements with the tag, filter the viewport to only show the elements with that tag, filter the scene window to only show the elements with that tag, or filter both the viewport and the scene window. The button on the right of the drop down will clear the current tag selection. The plus button on the far right of the header can be used to add tags. Once you've opened the add tag popover, simply type in a name and hit return to create that tag. Let's make a tag called text by typing the word and hitting return. Let's then drag all the text elements onto the tag to assign it. You can clear a tag by right clicking to see the contextual menu, then clicking clear tag. You can also delete tags from here. You can also delete tags by using the delete key on your keyboard. When you create a tag, the current selection can be added automatically. You do this in one of two ways, either tick the checkbox, add selection to new tag, or hold the alt key when you press return to make the tag. You can also create tag hierarchies in Calvary. To add a child tag to an existing tag, start typing the name of the existing tag, then if you like, use the autocomplete box that appears to finish the name, then add a forward slash, and now type the child tag name. When you hit return, a new child tag will be added to the existing tag. To create multiple tags at once, you can just type out the hierarchy with a forward slash between each level. When you hit return, all the tags will be made for you. With the tag drawer closed, using Command on the Mac or Control on Windows, Shift and T will still open the add tag popover. You can use the quick assign popover in the scene window to assign or even create tags. To create a tag, simply type the name of a tag that doesn't exist and hit return. The tag will then be created and the element will be added to the tag. Typing the name of a tag that already exists will simply assign that tag. To remove a tag, right click on an element and go to the remove tag menu item. There's also a select by tag menu item in the context menu. This also exists in the edit menu.